I was born after the 1979 revolution, but I know the Shah's modernization deepened economic inequities. It enriched and benefited an elite few and left the majority of Iranians suffering, leading to widespread anger and disillusionment. During the 1960s, those who opposed the Shah's reforms, the White Revolution, were met with deadly force and it marked a turning point in the Savak's dominance over Iranian lives, uh, where freedom of expression was obliterated and the press became a tool for state propaganda. The Shah's implementation of a single party system crushed political diversity and democracy and made political opposition voiceless and illegal. So the question is, do Iranians want to go back to that reign of terror? And I think the answer is a resounding no. The idea that this is a choice between the monarchy and the Islamic regime is a false dichotomy. And that's why we hear people chanting in the streets, down with the dictator, be it the Shah or the Mullah.